I'm your Huckleberry. Just a nobody from the bad woods. Everybody telling me that I'm no good. They say that boy don't act right. Yo, welcome back everybody. It's me, Z, and I'm back with another Red Dead Online video. Yo, what is good? Hope you guys are having a great day today. Now, I have a revised video of the money glitch method that I put out a few days ago. Uh, apparently, a lot of you people, well, not a lot, but some of you people were having uh, trouble with it getting up the hill. I uh, couldn't get up there with their horse, or they'd get the horse up there, but they couldn't get up there. So, I'm going to show you a couple different things that you could do. All right, so... This right here is a location where I was able to find a one-seater wagon. This is a one-horse wagon. So if you want to do this wagon method, uh, you can come over here and find a wagon. You can also find them in Strawberry and outside of Blackwater. Now, I found two different wagons right there, um, right above the I and the N, right there in that section of the map. And uh, what you're looking for, if you want to do this wagon method, is a wagon like this. It's a one-seater has a little cart and it's a one horse wagon. All right, like I said, you can also find them up here around Blackwater area and up near Strawberry as well. All right, so this is for the people who are having trouble getting up there on their horse. Let's say you get up there, your horse gets up there, but you don't. If you're having that issue, you might wanna go grab a wagon and take a wagon over there with you uh, to do this glitch. Go ahead and run your horse up the hill, get him to go in there, and then do the wagon glitch. Is where you get the wagon to the top of the hill, and it stops, and then you get, keep going right through with the wagon. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so we're going to be in this section of the map. We're in Rattlesnake Fork, right in between Twin Rocks, and right in between Rattlesnake Fork. Uh, that's what I meant to say. Right there at that little flat edge. We're almost to the corner. As you can see where all the blue dots are right there. Okay, so you need to come to this location. Now you can do this 100% solo. You can do it. It might take you a few tries and a little work, but you'll get it done. Uh, it's a lot easier if you have some buddies with you, though. Uh, it's a lot funner as well. All right, so as you guys can see right here, I'm just going to show you some fails. Now, one thing a lot of people don't understand, with this game, weather and time of day actually matters. You know what I mean? As you guys can see right here in this clip, it's nighttime. Uh, it's going to start raining. When knowing it rains, you, it does get more slippery. So, like I said, time of day and weather actually plays a part in being able to make this climb on this hill. So a couple ways you can do it is you guys can do it tandem on one horse. And what happens once you get up to the top of this hill, you want to mash triangle to try to jump off and back on the horse if possible. Or when you mash triangle, the horse will actually buck you forward up onto the hill. As you guys can see right there, that was a fail. All right, so here's another attempt that I'm trying right by myself. Now, keep in mind, I do think that if you're with a buddy, you guys should swap horses because it might be easier to ride someone else's horse up the hill. So keep that in mind. All right, so you guys can see as I get to this point, I'm spamming triangle. I'm spamming the button to get off of my horse. Now, there goes my friend City. Now, he gets his horse up there. So if this happens to you and you get your horse up the hill and you can't get back on your horse if that's happening to you then you're going to want to use the cart to get up on the hill so make sure you have the cart before you try that as you guys can see the horse is clearly up on the hill all right so right here uh one more time we're going to do this tandem you guys can see he gets off I actually stay on I'm spamming triangle so both of us jump off and the horse kept going right up the hill right out of uh, right of the map okay so that's what you want to do if you're doing this cart method if you had you know if you can't get back on your horse and it goes up by itself 
then you probably want to go get a cart and do this so you're going to do that cart method you can drive it all the way up same way all right and it's going to rear and then it's just going to pull you on up the hill so i'll send your horse up the hill first and then do the cart method that's for those of you that cannot get this solo or can, cannot get it on your horse all right so i'm going to show you guys right here as you guys can see now it is daytime and it is not raining anymore so the surface is a lot more dry so we're able to you know to do this a lot more easily we noticed after it stopped raining uh we was all able to get up the hill almost first try so it was pretty simple so as you guys can see that was my first try right there so i'm going to run it one more time and i got it on the second try okay now i'm going to slow this down for you guys pay close attention i put a marker next to this bush and that's when you want to start spamming the button to get off the horse i'd be spamming triangle all right so here we go all right so here's the bush on the left as soon as we get to this bush i'm spamming triangle right now i'm not just hitting it i'm spamming triangle you see the horse keeps running i jump off remember i'm spamming triangle okay so i'm spamming triangle he jumps back on the horse all right and i'm up in the map okay so it's that it is that simple dude um you can get this if you keep trying like i said conditions matter okay so i hope this video helps you i hope uh, a more uh explanation uh explanatory video i mean uh helps you guys get this glitch down uh because once you do get outside the map you can make a lot of money out here guys now as you guys can see we're out of the map and uh, I'm going to have my friend said he come up right after me. And uh, he also made it up no problem. So here he comes. All right. Now my friend was right behind him. He jumped off. His horse kept going. And he got left down the hill. So if you have a friend that's already outside of the map, you can use this method to go ahead and pull them up. Uh, if you got his horse up here, you know, the whole idea with this glitch, and I know a lot of people have been complaining, uh, that, you know, hey, this is out, people have seen it. It's about getting your horse outside of the map so you can farm as many animals as possible, okay? Now, if you're going to Mexico, you wanna go to the left and go around this direction to get to Mexico. Now, I'm gonna slow this map down real quick and I'm gonna show you guys. Some of you people are also having trouble getting back across the map. Now, if you come to the south, to this area right here, you will be able to get back across the map, no problem. It will drag you when you get close. Now, also, if you go north, you go up north to the snow area, it will drag you across the map back into the actual map, okay? So, you need to go either north or south to get back across the map. It will drag you across if you go to the right areas. Okay, so those of you that have not seen the money glitch video that I posted a few days ago, the whole purpose of this glitch, getting outside the map with your horse, is so you can stock up on animal pelts and cargo. The animals do not move. They're glitched out, and they do not move. So it makes it very easy uh, to farm up the animals. and get. You can also get a lot of XP doing this as well. So but you can stack your pelts, fill your satchel, get as many as you can. The animals do not run. Uh, they are usually in packs as well as you guys can see just like these skunks right here there's like 10 skunks right here in this one location half of them were three star skunks so if you can get out of the map and especially with your friends because it's fun to get out and journey and explore and make money in the process i do highly recommend it okay guys so uh, also check out the other video that i put out a little while ago it's unlimited xp uh, method I show three different spots to where you can gain unlimited XP in Red Dead Online It's very simple to do And you do gain a lot of XP you can rank up really fast for that uh, Also guys if you guys are interested in a weekly outfit showcase video if you want to be entered in that uh, Go ahead and send me a screenshot of your best Red Dead Online outfit on PS4 um, or send it to me on Twitter, Zazor909 on PS4 and Twitter. Alright guys, so I really hope this video helped you guys. It's informative. Uh, so please, if it did, like this video, share the video. 
Uh, let's see if we can get as much attention as we did in the last video. All right, guys. Uh, but again, if you want to get out of the map really easy, go north. No problem getting out of the map, okay? Uh, but that's going to be it for this video, guys. I really appreciate each and every one of you guys. Till next time, I'm your boy. Peace.